Let's get to Comfort Zero. Comfort Zero. There is a chess tournament going on today in Berlin. A small tournament, more of like a meetup group. And I am going there today with Anne. Anne hasn't played chess. When's the last time you played chess? I don't know, like two years old. Anne was two when she played chess. I was like 10. <laughs> Leute in einer Gruppe, die ersten zwei qualifizieren sich für die nächste Runde. So, weil wir haben insgesamt vier Gruppen, A5 Leute. Also zwei All you can hear is like the clicks from the clock. It's time chess. I've lost two games already and you can't talk at all and everyone speaks German and it's very, very quiet there. So going to go back in, play the rest of the tournament, see what happens, probably lose a bit, probably learn a bit, but the goal is really learn how to play chess and step outside of the comfort zone. Anne and I both signed up for this chess tournament thinking this would be a great Comfort Zero episode and thinking that it would be really super uncomfortable for us to go play chess. Just crossing the street here. Thinking that would be like a really uncomfortable thing for us to do because we don't play chess. Going to a German chess tournament, you think that would be an uncomfortable thing to do. But anyways, we got there and it really wasn't that uncomfortable at all. It was actually quite fun. Have fun. <laughs> we went into something thinking it would be so uncomfortable, but it was actually not uncomfortable at all. So I wonder how many other situations or experiences we're missing out on because we think they will be uncomfortable, but really at the end of the day, it was just a lot of fun.